Hello there dear youtubers my name is king1993 and today I'll be talking about a weapon which has been added to the game and the weapon is very interesting so without further ado let's get started first of all do understand that the, this uh, mecha is called alborada and alborada is a mecha that can you do the same skill as the weapon which has been added to the game okay so each secondary attack is capable of uh, do, doing homing damage so Wherever it goes, it basically attacks anything nearby. The similar can be said about this new weapon which has been added to the game called the Plasma Missile. So this Plasma Missiles, wherever it goes, it basically does a large quantity of damage as it goes. Like, like, like this, this weapon actually does more damage than Alborada. <laughs> that much powerful this uh, uh, missiles is. And the overall cooldown rate of this weapon is 2.5 seconds. Whereas for Alborada... Okay, let's see. For Alborada, let's uh, try to lower the secondary weapon's attack as much as possible. Let's see, secondary weapon. Okay. Uh, damage support after Alborada. Okay. Shield maker. Okay. Yeah, th that's the best I could do. Okay. Now, let's see. What is the total time needed to actually recharge? Okay, it takes about 8 seconds. It takes about 8 seconds to actually, uh, what should I call it, recharge is secondary attack. So when compared to this plasma missiles, the plasma missiles only take about 2.5 seconds. So as a result, what will happen is, uh, the moment you have a plasma missile, you can able to shoot uh, enemy makers up to 3 times, yeah, 3 times, whereas for Alborada, it can only shoot up to 1 time. Hmm. Okay, I actually didn't know Alborada has this has this ability of homing attack. Wow. Wow. Alborada can also do homing damage. Oh my god. I actually do not use Alborada that much. I didn't know that Alborada can also do homing. Wow, okay, anyway, so what is my point? My point is, if you want to use a weapon in a team deathmatch or in a battle royale, then obviously this plasma missile is a very good weapon, because it has homing uh, or let's say enemy seeking capability, not homing, enemy seeking capability. Now the question is, okay, if there are that many weapons, the question is then what is my favorite weapon? So let's talk about the homing capability. Obviously. There is Exploder Bot, uh, but the problem with the Exploder Bot is its range is very limited, okay? So I cannot actually use this for a long range battle. It doesn't matter if it is a team deathmatch or a battle royale, this Exploder Bot is out of option. Now, let's talk about these three weapons which I have already equipped. It. One is Smart Exploder Gun, Homing Missiles, and this Plasma Missile. Now, what is the first most powerful uh, homing weapon in this game? It is the homing missiles because it can actually detect enemies extremely far away like if even if i were to go out of stadium it can still detect where the enemies are and it can able to shoot them so that's the whole thing about this weapon is that its homing capability is extremely good okay let's see so it is it is 215 meters away and it can still hit them whereas for the exploder bot obviously it cannot okay now let's talk about this uh, smart exploder now i was shocked on how this weapon works so when you directly shoot like this okay when you shoot like this like when an enemy is nearby it will basically go towards the enemy for example i sh shot over there but it can it can still go towards the enemy so what does this mean? So what does this mean? It means that while your homing missiles is loading, you can use this smart exploder gun to actually does damage to the enemy. And it can be useful both in team deathmatch and in battle royale. Because the range of this weapon is extremely good, similar to that of the homing missiles. Like you can go extremely far up to this point and then still shoot. And it will basically does the hit up to 217 meters away. 
now finally last but not least is this one so i have tried it in the long range as well and it seems like it it can also do damage against mecha or a, let's say enemy pilot that are 218 or 17 meters away so overall uh my total conclusion is my best homing gun is the homing missiles my second uh, best homing gun is the smart explorer gun and my third most uh uh, favorite okay third favorite of homing gun is this plasma missiles okay so this is overall my conclusion on how good this plasma missile is and if you guys w are thinking about whether you should be using this weapon in the team deathmatch or not i highly suggest that you use this uh, weapon in team deathmatch i highly suggest that you use this weapon in team deathmatch and in battle royale as well because it will give you a huge advantage against mecha that are basically on top of the building because uh, do trust me when a certain mecha is on top of a certain building no matter how much you har try hard to actually shoot them you won't be able to shoot them easily that's the whole problem and this is the best solution which i can come up with okay and, and it is a very good thing that they have uh, added a weapon like this because otherwise what will happen is the game would have been gotten a lot imbalanced like the game is already was already a lot imbalanced because the game was like if you are on top of a building you will have higher chance of winning something like that but at least this uh, plasma weapon can now actually counter that okay so anyway if you like this video regarding this topic then please give a like and subscribe and click the bell notification icon to get more of this type of topic on a regular basis thank you and see you again next time target look at the damage.